Come to the special feature of our program, the appearance of our mystery celebrity, for which my friends on the panel are blindfolded. The blindfolds all in place, panel? Yes, the read. Very much. Good. Will you come in, mystery challenger, and sign in, please? Panel, as you know, in the case of our mystery celebrity, we go to a different form of questioning. You ask one question at a time in turn, moving clockwise, and we'll begin it all with Miss Arlene Francis. Well, that was a lovely reception for whoever it is. Uh, do you often have receptions like that when you appear in person? Uh, quelquefois, oui. <laughs> hey, that's pretty good. What yes, sometimes, quelquefois. Quelquefois? Yeah. Merci. Who opened the French windows? <laughs> Peter Lind, you're up. Am I up? Well, I, I judge from the squeals of the uh, gay young ladies sitting in our audience that this must be a handsome gentleman and uh, probably in the entertainment field. Are you uh, in the entertainment field? Uh, oui, monsieur, quelquefois. Uh, uh, pas tout le temps. Hmm? Pas tout le temps, je dis. Do you have anything to do with music? Mm. Pas trop, no, no, not too much. Mr. Andrews? Uh, instantly recognizable. I take it that you have appeared before through the medium of television. Uh, that is correct, sir. Miss Francis? <laughs> oh, it cannot be Maurice Chevalier. Impossible. He would speak with an English accent to fool us. Are you other than the Frenchman you seem? Mm, I have to answer this question in the affirmative. Uh, yes. The day? <laughs> Uh, well, in spite of the French accent, I detect a note of the English underneath the, the French accent, and probably out of deference to our vis visiting dignitary from England, I think that we probably have a, an English uh, motion picture star in our midst. Is that, is that right? This gentleman is quite smart. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think that's a fair assumption, Miss Kilgallen. Oh, are you also a dispatcher? I beg your pardon? Are you also in the theatre, living, legitimate type? Uh, no, I would not say that. That's one down and nine to go, Mr. Andrews. Are you, in fact, British or Irish? I'm British, monsieur. Miss Francis. Yes. I know who you But is. you have British. appeared in American motion pictures, as well as English? From time to time. One time, two time. Not too often. You can be English now. We all know. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That's my boy. <laughs> all righty, Mr. Hayes. I think I know who it is. Shall I pass? No, no go ahead. I'll pop. <laughs> well, you want to have a big night. You get two tonight, maybe. Yes. Well, go it'll go be ahead. the first time, and I know that uh, Jimmy Durante is opening at the... Oh, don't be a cad. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's Peter Lawford. Is who it is. <laughs> Time. Best French accent we've had in a long time, must I? <laughs> well, I tried. I think I did a little better the last time. Golly Day, you sure look healthy, man. What you been doing? Well, that son. I saw your brother-in-law, Senator Jack, in Washington. Oh, did you? And happily, I might say a lot of people say this happily. He's just looking as healthy as you are. Oh, he's in terrific shape, man. Yeah, he's good, good fellow. Well, Aren't you nice. more crew than last time? I beg your pardon. Aren't you more crew than last time? I, I chopped a little off. Yeah. He washed his hair in soft water. I thought maybe the Marine Colonel had inspired <laughs> <laughs> Well, Peter, I must say it was nice to have you back with us because we had your, the pleasure of your company before. Uh, would you like to say good night to the panel and uh, give Mr. Hayes a medal as you go by? We've well, got two tonight. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <Thank you. laughs>